peace loves i hope everyone is doing okay today so i did want to come up here and still do my youtube video i didn't do one last week i've been so busy if you guys don't know already i am hosting my first ever event it's been crazy, but I feel like everything is coming into alignment. Everything is really just coming together so beautifully. And that actually brings me to my topic for today. Today's topic is universal alignment. What even is universal alignment? How do you get into alignment? What even is universal alignment? Glad you asked. Universal alignment is basically when you're in line with your your true self, your higher self, as people say. And when we say your higher self, that just really is you in your purest, truest form. So your authentic self. Your true high self is you just following your purpose, your deepest desires, what you've always just wanted to walk in the light of doing and ever since i have sort of you know like an onion peeled back my layers by leaving the military quitting grad school and kind of getting rid of those layers that we have because we we as human beings we wear all these different masks and all these different masks that we put on are because we are trying to look good for somebody else or look good for a certain situation. And in reality, we are burying our true self. We are ignoring our highest self. And it never really dawned on me until I started to walk in this light, until I started to unearth what I really wanted to do and what my purpose was really in this lifetime. Ever since then, I'm telling you, everything kind of just started aligning. Universal alignment is so powerful because when I was out of alignment, that's when all the chaos was happening in my life. That's when I had, you know, car crashes. I lost this, can't find this, stressed out, got this going on, anxious because I got this going on. In reality, it's because we are operating off of fear or, or a sense of a lack of control. When you feel like you're not in control, that's where anxiety is rooted in. Anxiety is really just rooted in fear because yet again, false evidence appearing real. But ever since I began to just drop everything literally for myself and, and be in alignment with what I love to do, it has then created a plethora of just positivity, positive vibes. I mean, the people that I come across nowadays, multiple businesses that I've been meeting that are just good vibes, positivity, really want to succeed, like black moguls, like literally just a whole bunch of black entrepreneurs that are walking in a lot of their passion, are pursuing their desires, what they love to do. And it's not an easy thing to do, it is not. But I'm telling you, when you do, because I look at so many people that say, oh, this job is having this much money or, oh, it's got this incentive. But you're literally are limiting yourself to a dollar sign. And what I want to tell people is we just, we shouldn't do that. And I know that, yeah, you need money to survive. I get that. I was once there too. Trust me, I signed to the military. <laughs> if anybody knows, I know I was down bad for some bucks, but it's like I was ready to let all that go And I'm telling you I don't regret it a lot of people say you're gonna regret you leaving the military I don't I don't <laughs> like I've had so much peace these days I've been able to find myself and grow and learn so many things about who who I really am Because a lot of times we say oh like for instance, I'm Bianca. I don't even go by that name no more That's my my name given at birth. However, I'm, I'm more than that. I'm more than Bianca. I'm more than this physical plane. We're more than any of this. We have a soul, we have a spirit. And I was talking to somebody about spirituality on Facebook and I actually got a comment that says, we should leave spirituality out of things. And I feel like that's why we are where we are, especially as black people, we have taking spirituality out of everything. And I will not stop talking about it. I will not silence myself because spirituality really saved me. And there is a lot of individuals who have been reaching out to me to do a video with spirituality versus religion. Not really versus, I don't like the whole versus mindset, but spirituality in comparison to religion. There was a lot of questions I had 
as a religious person, you know, my past, my past self. Now that I know that we have a spirit, we have a soul that goes deeper than this physical plane, it changes the whole game. It's like a lot of questions that I had are starting to be answered. And you know, but that's another topic for another day. I also want to tell you guys about my event in Greensboro, North Carolina. It's gonna be at Greensboro Arboretum from 12 o'clock to 3 p.m. We're gonna have so many vendors. We're gonna have a live DJ. We got about eight vendors, food, music, good vibes, good times, support black businesses. It's gonna be outstanding. It's gonna be great. And I'm looking forward to it. Also, if you have not already, be sure to follow me at These Hidden Gems. I make crystal necklaces, oils, salves. Um, I got a new product dropping Friday for the event. I mean, I'm always working, guys. I, I love doing this. I love creating wellness products for my community because we gotta get our bodies back. We gotta get our bodies back in alignment. We gotta get our bodies back healthy and wealthy. I hope to see you all there at my event. If not, be sure to share my post at that girl Viney. I've been posting many, many posts throughout this week. If you follow me, you know. So just pick one, choose it, reshare it, comment on it, put an emoji. It's free to support. It's so free to support. I hear so many people say, I don't have money or I don't have the funds to support you right now. Honey, your phone work. Get up there, comment, reshare, uh, send it to a friend, save the post. As long as y'all interacting with businesses posts, that's enough support right there within itself. You never know who, you know, will be put on when you share this post. But I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. I will see you guys next time. Be sure to hit that subscribe button if you have not already and have a good night.